What's happening folks, how are we all doing? Back to doing some work on the van Now that we're into winter pretty much 31st of October today Time to finally fit my diesel heater I had this in my old van it was on once So Get it fitted for some winter adventures So this is where the heater's got to sit I sit facing up into the van Sat the tank I'm placing in, that'll come back out and so that I can put the fuel line down through, I'll put the pump underneath and that will go up into the fuel line on the actual heater itself. So I've got the floor all sealed with this fire retardant fireproof sealer mastic. Just uh, as an extra precaution in case any fumes can leak through it and I will also put a bead on this before that gets screwed and bolted to the actual floor. So I'm going to put the fuel pump under here, like so. I've got, you see that grommet there with the seal around it? That is where the fuel line will come through. Pump will come here. There is already a hole for some electrics up here which I'll use for the electrics for the fuel pump but I've got my rev nut gun so I'm going to drill, fit a rev nut and bolt that to the van here So I'm going to fit the exhaust and the clean air intake first before we fit it. He's going here, it's a lot easier. The exhaust pipe is further away from the fuel line. That's the fuel line there, that's the exhaust, that's the clean air. So you can see I'm going to have the clean air intake coming up and behind the spare wheel there and the exhaust is going to come out and at the back of the vehicle here we've got the muffler to go on it so that's underneath our fade, the exhaust, clean air pump and uh, electric so now I just need to wire up the electrics on the inside Let's get some fuel in it, give it a try so the electrics are all in place, everything's in place and you get some fuel in it connect it up, get it primed and make sure it all works and then tidy all up the electrics so I've got some fuel in it, everything's all connected up now we need to prime the pump so you push OK and down and then I believe you push up till it comes on and I can hear the fuel pump clicking away underneath that should start pumping fuel through and now that I'm pretty confident that all the fuel is pumped through pumped through here, underneath there seems to be no air in the fuel line I can fire it up and obviously these are all the wires and stuff but they all get dealt with oh it's turning on So the diesel heater is all in place, electrics are on, I've got fuel in it, primed, gave it a wee test run, now I'm back home, I've got to turn it on, got to try my wee remote out and see how much it heats up now that it's getting pretty cold in this chilly Halloween evening in Scotland. So here goes. So that's banging out heat, took no time at all to get up to temperature, just need to go through the instructions and figure out how to control the fan speed and stuff like that so it's not on so loud and fast all the time if that's even a thing I'll find out so now that I know that this diesel heater is up and running and banging out heat there is only one thing left for it and that is to plan a trip for this weekend now that we're coming into winter here in Scotland thanks very much for watching 
hopefully see you then peace i am out